So you mentioned Carlton as um, doing the winter campaign against the Navajo and Kit Carson having to conduct that campaign. And you also mentioned in the book, and a couple of times that stood out to me, is that Carlton was thinking about exterminating Native Americans. Um, what did he mean by that? So extermination was one of these terms that was, you know, quite popular. Well, popular is not really the good term, but um, it was it was commonly used um, mm -hmm. among military and political officials in shaping Indian policy. Right. And among Northerners and Southerners too, it's important to remember that Confederates also. Um, had extermination in mind in some cases. Um, John Baylor and Henry Sibley uh, advocated for uh, luring Apaches into parlays and, and then killing all the men and enslaving the women. Um, and Carlton's plan was a little bit different than that. Um, his plan was if he could not um, actually exterminate Native peoples physically, uh, then he would exterminate them culturally. And so um, the plan was to abandon any kind of treaty making and uh, to make war first in order to force Native peoples to capitulate and then remove them um, forcefully to reservations and then, as I noted before, convert them um, into civilized, uh, possibly Americans, maybe not, but civilized peoples. Um, so that was part, uh, extermination was sort of the first go, and then uh, the Indian policy evolved into um, that multi-pronged approach, um, not to kill all, all, all Native peoples, but to um, attempt to destroy their culture. 